those who worship the asphalt surf gods, your time has come yet again. Skate 3, the game made for skaters by skaters, returns with more sick tricks, customizable environments, and bone-crushing wipeouts. Hope you have health insurance. All right, we just sacrificed a virgin, and by virgin I mean one of the X-Play employees, and we actually used that black magic to suck Cuz out of the game and transport him here into real life. His name is Chris. He's like some kind of producer on Some kind of somebody. He works on Skate 3 in some way, shape, or form. Now, Chris, we talked about uh, this game at PAX East. There were people waiting in line for hours to get their hands on this. One of the big things we're looking at today, uh, co-op, something that yeah. we're going to talk about. Tell me about that. This is something that's really exciting to a lot of people, so, so well, do that with me. I, I'm, I'm excited about it because you know we can play a challenge together, You know, and as we're doing it, we both get credit for it, as opposed to a lot of those games where you know, like, hey, come and play my game with me, and then you go back to your game and nothing happened yeah, in your wait a world. Minute. Yeah, yeah. Man, no, I'm just still ours on is training like, wheels. Our, ours is fully like whatever you do, you're trying to sell skateboards in your game, I'm trying to sell them in mine. If we play together, we can set up photos and do whatever, we both get credit for it. Wow, and, and you guys have been known in the past to kind of respond to what the community has to say. It seems like the community directs a lot of the decisions you guys make in yep. your games. Is that something that a lot of people really wanted and then you addressed it in this? Well, I, I think what a lot of people want to do is just like, how about a little something for the effort? You know, like, yeah. hey, we're out there playing, we're, we're hanging out together why don't we get something and uh, it can be from the creative aspect of it of creating a skate park uploading it if people download it you know you get credit for it you sell skateboards or competitive we have new game modes like uh, domination one up and stuff like that where we can actually compete against each other and we can compete as a team or individually and again we're still getting credit towards moving our game forward cool and let's talk about those new game modes just run through them uh, for me starting with well domination domination is you got a whole series we've been famous for called owning the spot where you have something to skate and you want to you know get the high score on that domination is a series of spots in the same area and we try to get those one up is more of a head-to-head point battle and you can do those as a team so if you really suck you know you could just like not move because if you move and you wipe out, you end your team's turn. Really? So, like, you'll definitely hear people like, dude, dude, dude just chill. You're not good yeah. here. Just chill. Yeah. And then let's talk about some of the environments, obviously, what we saw here. More of a traditional skate park environment. What else are we going to see in Skate 3? So, we have everything in the game from, you know, the Danny Way's just mega park where he's taking the vision of skateboarding there to skating a curb. Like, you know, like, it's, it's in everything in between. We have some real-life spots. We, we model stuff after real life, but we never claim it to be exact replica because, you know, as soon as you mess that up, people get agitated. So we're like, no, no, no. It's, it's like, you'll recognize it if you skate. Skate parks, city streets, industrial areas, pools, everything. Really, nice. like, it's it's a lot of everything. And then just take a, a huge step back here and just to, how many skaters do you have in the game? There's just, you know, all the basics. 28, 30, we have uh, 28 or 30 skaters. A couple of uh, surprise guests in there. It's huge, like th- just the number of people that have been involved. And we l- really look at it as a family. Thrasher Magazine and the Skateboard Mag are back. And uh, it's become part of sort of the skate family. And like once you're in, we want you to stay in. All right, if you're watching this segment, you like to skate. So I don't need to introduce this dude, Danny Way. He's a legend. How does this game feel? How does it compare to the real thing? I mean, it's... It is the game that I think all the skateboarders appreciate because it is, uh, you know, the most realistic game out there. The, the movements on the game mimic the real live movements that we actually uh, used to, to skateboard with. You know, the physics of uh, skateboarding were translated into the controller. Put your stamp of approval on this game. Why should people pick up Skate 3? I think that, you know, Skate 3 is a, is a perfect example of, or, you know, a simulation of what skateboarding is about. I think, you know, if you want to experience skateboarding and don't necessarily want to go out and break yourself doing it, I think you can get a good experience through the game and uh, not necessarily have to uh, pay the price that you would physically in real life. Here's thanks to Chris and Danny for being here again, guys. The game is out on May 11th on the 360 and the PS3. The demo is out right now. Back to you, Adam.